Well, joining us now from New York is Daron Kempel, the founder and CEO of Bond. And Daron, thanks for joining us. Maybe just start a little with your personal background, uh, because that is certainly relevant to the subject we're discussing. Thank you, Kalev. Background, so born in Israel and served in the military for about 13 years. I was second in command of Sayeret Matkal. Moved to the United States in 1994, studied here, has been or have been a serial entrepreneur, mainly in the information technology sphere. Both prior companies were acquired by IBM and Hewlett Packard. And in May 2017, three and a half years ago, I started this company named Our Bond, is Our Bond with you, which aims to enhance personal security and peace of mind for individuals and communities by intertwining cutting edge novel technologies with human operational excellence. Uh, can you give us a, a, a little more specifics on this? How does this work? Who, you, who uses it? And exactly what kind of protection or extra layers of security does it prov provide potentially? Thank you. So let's take a step back and look at what the problem is. The problem is that most of security has focused on buildings. In other words, if you're inside the building, you're reasonably protected. But when you're outside of the building, walking, maybe you're in a ride-sharing vehicle, maybe you're outdoors doing something, there is no real security to you unless you dial 911. But mostly, when you're already feeling very uncomfortable, 911 is not yet the solution because in order to dial 911, it needs to be an emergency. So there are numerous situations where we and people whom we love are uncomfortable, scared, perhaps at risk, but they're not yet a 911 emergency. And for those situations, like walking alone at night, walking to a parking garage, maybe having some uh, dialogue with somebody whom you're concerned about, maybe you're in a ride-sharing vehicle, maybe you're a real estate agent, you're showing an apartment to somebody you don't know. In all those situations, there is no systemic solution that is preventative. In other words, somebody or some entity that you can reach out to who can be by your side. That is what we have established. A platform with a very rich spectrum of services, where at the high end of the spectrum of services, we even offer bodyguards on demand. We make bodyguards as easy and affordable to reach out to as it is now to order dinner online. So basically we're taking what Uber has done for transportation, we're offering that to bodyguards. But at the lower end of the spectrum, we offer on-demand monitoring and keep an eye type of uh, services. So for instance, we have a service called Track Me On The Go. You can apply that to yourself, to your family, to your children. Basically we track the individual from one location to another and we can detect any anomalies and reach out. Why is that? Because the platform anchors Kalev on 24-7 personal security agents in our bond command centers, East Coast and West Coast. They're available within seconds via an app. Other than the service that I referenced to you that is called Track Me On The Go, the app has numerous other services. One of the most popular services is video monitor me. You push the button and a security agent appears on video on your screen, can guide you. Hi, Daron, this is Steve with Bond. I'm live in my situation. Steve, thank you for reaching out so quickly on the push of a button. I'm on a call here with Kalev. I felt a little uncomfortable. Want you by my side. I feel better now. I'm going to show you Kalev. You do not need to discourage him in any way. I'm just demonstrating. There you go, Steve, meet Kalev. Hi, how are you? <laughs> I'm intimidated. I feel I feel better now. Can I disconnect? Absolutely. Thank you for choosing Bond Drone. We're here for you 24-7. Thank you. So variety of services, they're all anchored by humans. So this is not just an app I with technology. This is a platform with trained background check security agents available within seconds on the app. We can monitor your loved ones. We can be by their side. Notice that I asked them not to discourage you. Typically, when somebody whom you're uncomfortable with is approaching you, the security agent will suggest that right. you introduce him or her. And typically, people don't want to be on video right. recording when they're about to do something embarrassing or risky. Now, obviously, this is a uh, the, this is an app or this is a system, a security system that can apply to any variety of situations, as you said. Uh, but because again, this is I24 News. 
We're looking especially at its application to uh, uh, visible Jewish communities, uh, Jewish institutions, especially, as we said, in a time when we see rising anti-Semitic incidents. Talk a little about that. Great. So one need not be a sociologist to understand that the COVID reality may have slowed down a rise of anti-Semitism in this country, in the United States, and beyond. And my personal estimation is that with COVID subsiding, but with the economy being on the downturn and rule of law being degraded, police is not stronger and more equipped now than it has been a year ago, we're going to see a return to that uh, ugly uh, phenomenon. Now, we already have Jewish communities in the United States as customers. They've all gotten on the platform before COVID has uh, sadly set in. And what we do on their behalf is, of course, we make this service available to members of the community. So for $10 per month, any individual, any Jewish uh, member of the community can reach out to us, can download the app on the app stores, Apple or Google, and we instantly make ourselves available to her, to him, to their uh, family. Similarly, the community can use us as their virtual command center in terms of orchestrating activities, being able to receive any calls from members of the community, etc. So in short, Kalev, this is available nationally already. We have more than 150,000 right. members nationally, including uh, Jews in Jewish communities. And we've handled more than 40,000 cases, right. some of them severe. Well, uh, it's, an, it's unfortunate in a way, Daron, that this kind of service is needed, but that is the reality uh, nowadays. Daron Lempel of Bond, thank you for joining us on The Rundown. Thank you, Kalev. Happy holidays.